Antarctica is a lot warmer than it should be. Since the beginning of September, temperatures in the atmosphere above Antarctica have soared by over 35 degrees C. This all seems to be linked to changes in sea ice in Antarctica. That's the story at the bottom of all of this, is it? Yes, exactly. Since we started using satellites to measure sea ice extent, that was back in 1979, the patter of ice cover in Antarctica has been pretty stable. But since 2016 in Antarctica, there's been a kind of sudden shift that scientists have been calling a regime shift, where we've seen a number of record low sea ice extents in the summer. And even in the last couple of weeks, winters, the maximum sea ice extent has hit record lows. And scientists are worried that this could suggest the continent has passed a tipping point of no return. So if you get rid of the sea ice and expose the landline ice to the water, then that dramatically increases the threat of catastrophic global sea level rise. We're talking mm. tens and tens of metres. Then you've also got the albedo effect of the sea ice. So white sea ice reflects radiation while darker ocean waters absorb it. So if you remove the sea ice from Antarctica, the oceans will warm more quickly and that will kind of accelerate future global warming. So it's a bit of a vicious cycle. And that's before we've even got to the impact on Antarctic ecosystems. So we've already seen, for example, Example, mass mortalities in some penguin colonies because the sea ice is melting before the chicks can fledge. 